he said, bring on the Acts 1 and 8 said, when you receive the Holy Ghost, you shall receive what? Power. Power. God said, because I rose, yes. Come on, man. I give you that power. Yes. Come on, say amen. Amen. All right, let's move on. Number five, when I have the opportunity to do good, whenever you have the opportunity to do good, according to Proverbs 3, 27, do, without, do not withhold good from those who deserve it, while it is in your power to act. Mm. If it's in your power to do something about it, don't withhold good, now, now get this word here, from those who what? Deserve, deserve it. <laughs> Somebody say amen? amen. Stop that undeserving people play on your Somebody say amen up in here. Is this good? Is the word of God good? Don't be so quick to get your stuff. This all oh, Lord have mercy. But when you can and they deserve it, don't hold back. Because see, God gave you the power to take care of the situation. So I say amen. But don't use what you have to someone who don't deserve it. And some folks, I'm going to tell y'all, they don't deserve it. But God, the blessing of God is giving you. Amen. So I want to say that. Amen. All right. Ecclesiastes 11 4 says, if you wait for perfect conditions, you will never get anything done. Listen, don't be caught up waiting on perfect conditions to get things done. Amen. People kill me talking about uh, the ladies to my to my daughters, amen here, uh, coming up, amen. When that joker tell you, well, listen here, I'm gonna marry you when I get myself together, I work on some things here. You might want to go and walk away. Amen. Somebody say amen? Because they ain't going to never be in the right position. They ain't going to never be themselves together. Y'all want to say nothing in life. Amen. I know sisters say amen, praise God, and wait now three or four years. Y'all want to say amen? amen? He's still trying to get himself together. All right, all right, all right. Somebody say he did go and preach and shout and maybe room a little bit. Amen. Praise the Lord. Amen? amen. All right. Second Corinthians 6 and 2 says, God is ready to help you right now. Today is the day of salvation. And they're going to get out of here. Amen. Now the last one is, when God offered me salvation, don't wait on it. Salvation means deliverance. What does salvation mean? Deliverance. Salvation means deliverance. When God offered you deliverance, why? What are you waiting on? Somebody say amen. amen. John 9 and 4 says, all of us must quickly carry out the task assigned by us by the Father who sent me. Because there is no time left before night fall. And all works come to an end. There is going to come a time when all work will come to an end. And God has given you a task, an assignment, get it done. Amen. You see this morning, praise God, through Evangelist Beard, uh, 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 that Beard, praise God, she took those dumb girls, angels of praise, of bring God to the church. She taught them to others and she molded and shaped. Somebody say,